desiring seed of my father. Oh, that goes back to what he was just saying about we're going to beat these heathens over the head with a rod of iron. That's right. We're going to, as scripture said right there, we're going to rule the heathen with a rod of iron. Okay? That's what's going down. Man, a spiritual ass one. That's right. A spiritual ass one. Here you go. Um, Isaiah 54 and 6. For the Lord have called thee as a woman forsaken, grieved in spirit, and a wife of youth. Yeah, because uh, like Israel's likened unto a woman. Just like when you read about that woman in Revelation, the 12th chapter, that's talking about Israel. Okay, I'll go ahead. Um, as a woman forsaken, grieved in spirit, and a wife of youth, when thou was refused, said the Lord, for a small moment have I forsaken thee. Oh yeah, hold up. That, that go back. That's why, that's why the Lord's called the husband then. We're called the bride. Israel's known as the bride. And the Most High is the husband. And we married to the Most High. And a lot of our people have committed adultery against the Most High. Hmm. Right. Yeah, everybody has. Yeah, really. Yeah. We got some people going to keep doing it. Yeah. Right. Some, two, most people. For a small moment have I forsaken thee, but with great mercies will I gather thee. With great mercies. Yeah, because the Lord is a merciful Lord. All right. That just proves that whole, that whole thing. People try to say you're going to, when you, if you're evil, when you die, you're going to be uh, burned forever in hell. <laughs> Yeah, that's retarded. The most high is merciful. <laughs> That'll never happen. That's funny. That is amazing that people believe that shit. It's amazing that people believe that shit. That's amazing, man. People, people stand, man. But, damn, I see all these fucking fine ass hoes out here. Oh, that's a bitch that was stripping over in no, the lawn. She's probably high on PC. Get her on camera. She was stripping over there in the lawn. She was stripping. She was dancing. Oh. All right. Don't be floor. Floor cover. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Oh, hold up. I was. Y'all you, hear that? Uh, I like some country. You ever listen to Willie Nelson? And, uh, Willie Nelson and uh, not Merle, uh, What's your boy's name? The Good Old Boys. Uh, you know. Uh, God damn, man. I need to be punched. <laughs> What's your Willie Nelson partner, man? Uh, Waylon. Huh? Waylon. Yeah. Dylan. No shit. Waylon Jennings. Oh. Y'all, y'all know about Waylon Jennings. Y'all know about that. Sure, I do. Oh, so yeah. You know nah, but I he do. Get, but Waylon Jennings got that I grew song. Up listening to that. But he got that song <laughs> with Willie. Uh, it, it, what was that? Uh, Lukenbach, Texas. He got that song. He said there's only two things in his life that makes it worth living: guitars that tune good and firm feeling women. <laughs> So that's an Israelite for your ass right that's there, right. man. Really, my dude. But I seen a bunch of firm feeling women out here today, boy. That's right. I was looking at these hoes. God damn, son. So the Most High, he gonna give us all kind of women. When we get that power. Yeah, when we get that, we got plenty of women. In a lot of water, that could be Yeah, because you know, they give you that. Yeah, they give you that. Like, gone out of the map right now. I'll cut it up. She alright. That, that one bitch who came by earlier was way better. She actually looked like a... Yeah, a little trashy. A kind of dude. A little trashy looking whore. I got whore. a fame for her. Because you know she ain't got no high maintenance on her right now. Yeah. Like, you know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah, because bitch... I hate, there's no worse than a bitch to wear makeup all day. You know, a bitch like that are like sincere. Oh, yeah? You know what I mean? Yeah. That bitch is a crack for Hey, a lot of times the crackheads are sincere people. <laughs> <laughs> they just can't handle life and they get cr cracked yeah. out. That's right, that's right. Because they ain't get angry. Hey, there goes your homie. You came back for round two. If you ain't grounded in no truth, man, you can lose it. See, we ain't never gonna get strung out on drugs and shit because we grounded, man. Yeah, we're grounded. We have a foundation. You know? But we got an anchor. We got an anchor holding us down. So. You know that destruction's coming soon. Y'all know America's about to be destroyed, right? According to the Bible, the biblical prophecies. Y'all know nothing about no biblical prophecies. Y'all probably homosexual. Who you gonna say is homosexual? Oh, God, they first come to OSU. He just takes his life and start, start experimenting and shit. Yep. 
Bro, it starts off with bug chugging, then that next thing is sucking cow. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, I already poured some shit down your ass. Might as well touch your balls now. They do gay shit, man. They, man, all this work that you You can't concentrate sometimes, buddy. Oh, shit. Gangsta, she don't curse us out like 50 times. Like five or 50 times. Here you go. In a little, in a little wrath, I hid my face from thee for a moment. Yeah, so the most I ain't gonna turn away his face forever. That's why he sent his son. You know what I'm saying? Yep. But. With everlasting kindness will I have mercy on thee, so the Lord thy with, with, what, Read that again. It's um, a kid, because this that destroys that myth of hell. Right. But when you die, like the Lord is not going to punish no one forever. There's no such thing as hell in the Bible. All right, the word hell is there, but hell is an English word. And the Bible was not written in English. The word hell is actually a Norse goddess. Hell is a Norse goddess, and it's, it's, it's not in the original Bible. The original Greek word in the Bible is Gehenna, which was an actual place on Earth. It was in South Jerusalem. It's where they burn all the trash. and it was a dump, it was a dump Yeah, it's where people, they worship. You had devil worshipers that used to go down there and sacrifice children, too. So when they said you was gonna burn in Gehenna, it was a metaphor saying you gonna be destroyed. You know, it's something to say that to you to put the fear of the Lord in you. You know what I mean? Yeah. Right, like you need to tell your children. Like, like we tell people all the time that they're going to get burned up. You know what I mean? That's when the missiles start coming. When, when it start raining missiles, that's hell. That's hellfire. In a little wrath, I hid my face from thee for a moment. But with everlasting kindness will I have mercy on thee. So the Lord, yeah, so it says everlasting mercy. It didn't say everlasting destruction and everlasting burning in hell forever. It ain't say that. No. That don't make no sense. Here you go. Um, we're still talking about Israel getting that strength back, right? Oh, you can get whatever, you know. man. So that's the only way we're gonna get these fine ass firm bitches walking around. <laughs> but in the meantime, while we out here just out having shit. Yeah, because these hoes need money and we ain't got no money for them. I can't take it. I can dig them down. Yeah. That's just about it. I ain't got no Cause like the whole a woman just wanted the money and the power. Yeah, I'll do that. I can come over and we can cook something. That's why that's why a Take woman gets if you tell a woman you got VIP tickets in the for the club, <laughs> she thinks you a superstar. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that, bitches only, only they only impressed by money and power, man. That's right, that's right. If you ain't got money, you ain't got no bitches. I mean pretty much. But usually that is the case when you look at it. Whoever, whoever got money got a fine ass woman. No matter, they could be ugly. They look like goddamn dude off a of sling blade. They, they, they can look like a goddamn rat. They can be a rat too. And they have the finest bitch. Just like your boy uh, Sterling from the uh, Clippers. Oh, right. Had that fine ass hoe. That, that, that slut. He, he an old ass Jew motherfucker. He goddamn 80 years old. This bitch is sucking his big 80 year old dick. How disgusting is that? But you know he never takes a bath. <laughs> Look at these hoes, boys, hoes everywhere. Everywhere. God damn. Isaiah 40 and 29. He giveth power to the faint. And to them that have no might, he increases strength. Oh, shit. Oh, you gotta get on. I said loud ass words like I like that. You gotta get on. Oh, Isaiah 40 and 29. Oh. Um, Isaiah 40 and 29. Oh, let me start at 28. Go ahead. Okay, this is Isaiah 40 and 28. Has thou not known, has thou not heard that the everlasting power of Yahweh, the Lord, the creator of the ends of the earth, fainteth not, neither is worried. There is no searching of his understanding. He giveth power to the faint and 
to them that have no might, he increases the strength. All right, that's us. That's all money. We ain't got no power. We're faint. We, uh... We just have it. Yeah, we, 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 we just a shadow of Like, when you was like... Imagine how you was when you was like 18. Yeah. We ain't shit, bro. You know what I mean? We ain't own no property. We ain't got no kind of possessions. No control of our kids. No, yeah, no control of our own children and families. The state is in control of everything. The government is in control of everything. Right. Yeah, you have no say so on uh, your children. Like, if, if you're married to a woman, she can divorce you. There's nothing you can do about it. Take that's all your shit. That, yeah, she'll take everything. That's take totally. Shit. That's yeah. totally. They take, they take all your shit, right? And that's take totally against shit. the Bible. Totally, what? Totally against the Bible. Like all the laws in America is all, is all, they all go against the Bible. Like the Bible says you're not supposed to charge anybody usury when you loan them money. But every time you buy a house, you buy a car, uh, you get a loan from the bank, they always charge you interest. And so a lot of times the interest be high as hell. Okay, and that, that's, that's illegal. That goes against the laws in the Bible. Student loans, collect interest. It's a so-called Jew that does it. They, they're all the bankers. They control all the banks. Yeah. They print the money. So, And they know about that law. They're well aware of that law. And they claim that they're the chosen people. Here is the so-called Jew who's not a Jew. They claim to be the chosen people. But if they're the chosen people, then how come they charging everybody usury? And they claim to be our brothers. Oh, they're just lovely people. They're wonderful people. And they're robbing your ass. Even the youth shall faint and be worried, and the young men shall utterly fall. That's a future prophecy that's coming. Oh. Yeah, a lot of these young men out here. Like we had these faggots out here a couple weeks ago. They was out here rapping. We was out here teaching, and they came up with a uh, amplifier, started rapping. All, so all they care about is that worldly bullshit. They just want to be a famous rapper. Look, there ain't no more famous rappers, okay? Can't everybody be a fucking rapper? How many goddamn rappers is it? It is unlimited. Some Hamites, huh? Ethiopians. Yeah, nobody wants to hear that shit, man. Y'all know America's about to be destroyed. Y'all ain't know that. I don't think they don't know that shit. They keep coming over. They, see what they, they flood in this country with heathens on purpose, man. You gonna kill them motherfuckers too? Yeah, so. You gonna kill them motherfuckers too? It's all part of the plan, so yeah. But they that wait upon the Lord shall renew their strength. They shall mount up with wings as eagles. They shall run and not be worried. Oh, uh, we're gonna be like Hancock. Yeah. We're gonna be like, uh, yeah. <laughs> be like a superhero, a power, a power man and iron fist. Shit, shit, Hancock ain't gonna be shit to what we gonna be. Hancock got weak when that bitch came around. Oh, uh, yeah, actually, yeah, Hancock did. He turned into an Uncle Tom. Yep. Yeah, he did. Shaved his beard. Shaved his beard off. He actually let him lock him up in prison. Yep. That was yep. some faggot shit, man. That's, no shit. That's why I can't even watch Hollywood movies no more. Just because he wanted the, like, the dude that he was dealing with one of them. Because the people wasn't embracing that's some Jews motherfuckers. That's right, right. Fuck you. Fuck you shit, yeah. Right, right, right. That's what we want. So, That's what we want, too. Fuck this world. Fuck everybody in this world. Yeah, yeah. Fuck these people. Exactly how Hancock was. Ain't, ain't no motherfucker eating Michael Walker to us to, you know, just like dude said that. It's not hard to talk loud. Remember he said? Yeah, they yeah. always get scared. When you start talking loud, they're like, why are you yelling at me? What? What? I got to say, man. They want everybody to come up here and soften this up, man. You can't soften this up. It's not possible to people, talk to people get scared if you raise your voice. You know what I'm saying? I would have been that like scared of those girls. That's the little one against the stone. Yeah, we're going to be bashing the human might, baby. Bash him against the stone. What is that shit, man? Is that coming from the fucking motorcycle? Yep. What the fuck? That is loud as shit. Boys, what's it called? Boys? Boys, boys? 
like. Here you go, Psalms 91 and 7. Um, a thousand shall fall at thy side, and ten thousand at thy right hand, but it shall not come nigh thee. That's the right, it's going to be all kind of death. You know what I mean? Because it's going to be crazy out here. It's, it's, it's going it's to be worse than the walking dead. <laughs> right. It's going to be crazy out here. It's already crazy out here. I'm a madness out here, man. Mighty man. Isaiah 14 and 3. And it shall come to pass in that in the day that the Lord shall give thee rest from that sorrow and from that fear and from the hard bondage wherein thou was made to serve. That thou shalt take up this proverb against the king of Babylon and say, How hath the oppressor ceased? The golden city ceased. The yep. Lord has broken the staff of the wicked and the scepter of the ruler. He who smot the people in wrath with a continual stroke. Esau. He that ruled the nations in anger is persecuted and none hindereth. The whole earth is at rest and is quiet. They break forth into singing. Yea, the fir trees rejoice. That's part of that continual stroke. That happened in America. Yeah, right, right. The trees were rejoiced. Oh, yeah, the trees were rejoiced. This all, this all used to be forest, right? They chopped all the trees down. Right now, this whole earth is going against this white man. Earthquakes, tsunamis, even trees, the, even the animals. Animal, the animals are turning against Yeah, I know what the hungry places look like. Huh? What are you talking about? I can't hear you. I think it's like a food place to go hungry or something. Hungry? I got food. We got this food. That's all the food we got is this. I'll just put a wing to go wing. This is, we got, a, we got, uh, we serving, uh, yeah, this is a dinner time right here. It's probably up that way. We got free food. You don't want no free food? I'm good, thank you. You gonna go get some welfare cheese? That's why they got here looking for the restaurant. Oh, he didn't eat them, honey. Oh, he didn't eat them. He was a big one. Ethiopian. See, he's got damn heaters everywhere, man. They fucking stink, too. They got weird smells on them. Oh, yeah. They all up in everything. Oh, yeah. You see? Like, man, ain't no worse than a goddamn Somalian, man. It's some stinky motherfucker. Who the fuck let Somalians move into the same neighborhood? Uh, who the fuck let Somalians into the country? So you, only, only the goddamn devil would do that, man. Cause you know that shit ain't right. No, no, not, I've never met a single person. People can say that, that oh, I'm not a racist. You a goddamn liar. That, nobody likes Somalians. Now, one person I ever met said they like Somalians. <laughs> Ever. You show me somebody that said they, they like are low people, man. They're low nation people. They're foul. Yeah. Foul. Foul. Yeah. Foul. Yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. yeah. They think that's just I caught it inside. I caught it, you know? Because I'm always listening to these fucking dancing motherfuckers. Just listen to what they be saying, man. And they make mockery of the control trials in Israel. Yeah, when we were sitting on the porch. Well, see, that, that, but that's funny, though, because they going right into slavery. Yep. They going to learn they all... They hate us, man. They hate the shit out of us, man. Damn Hindus stink up the place. Really like that's my head right here. Oh man, well I got this one over here then. I seen her. <laughs> yeah, that's the me right here. I claim I claim this song. Me right there. I think that's the same one I seen earlier. Yeah, that's the same. Dang, she she fit fit too. Delicious. Yeah, she fit. She fit. Yeah, scripture. Hey, we gonna get them though. Scripture says that Zephaniah 3 and 8. Therefore wait ye upon me, said the Lord until the day that I rise up to the prey. 
For my determination is to gather the nations, that I may assemble the kingdom, to pour upon them my indignation, even all my fierce anger, for all the earth shall be devoured with the fire of my jealousy. So the earth's gonna be devoured with fire. That's why we tell people they're gonna get burned up. But how you gonna say people gonna get burned up? That's what the Bible says. Man, that's a, that's a reoccurring theme in the Bible. It's destruction by fire. Over and over. I'm an American copy. How are you doing? You know that? Man. She looked like she was ready to suck some cock. Probably just got done. Still ready to do some more. Eating each other's tushy, tushy lovers. Yeah. Because that's what they do, even the homosexuals and shit. All these goddamn bastards, they can eat each other's ass out. Foul ass, foul ass, people. Eat each other's fucking ass out. They got videos. Shit out your ass. All type of bacteria. Well, you got people that eat shit. You shit out your fucking ass. They call it scat sex. Right. That's popular. P bitches like getting pissed on and shit on. What the fuck is wrong with these people, man? And they think something wrong with us. We out here telling them something wrong with them. Most of these women, they'll let you piss in their mouth. Yeah, yeah. If you really yeah. act like, baby, I want to try yeah. something new yeah. with you. Yeah. If she bad, it ain't new to her. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Pissing in their mouth. Big even had all his albums. Oh, Biggie? Bitches. That was back in the 90s, yeah. He, has, he uh, said bitch. he sh shit on a bitch. Yeah. That's when R. Kelly was doing his bitch pissing most in the late 90s. Oh, yeah, he was pissing most. That was the late 90s. He was pissing on the other Yeah, that was on Dave Chappelle, too. You know? Pissing on bitches. <laughs> Like James Hetfield. Mm -hmm. Sounds like you got a lawnmower in it. That, that car sounds wonderful. It sounds lovely. I'm a horsepower man, personally. Yeah, I like them old cars, man. Them old muscle cars are shit. They're made out of this pure steel. You got deep end this. Boom. That's horsepower. Scriptures speak about uh, the horses. It's not talking about horses falling in the air and shit. Some scriptures. The horses then yeah. jumping in the streets. And horsepower. Yeah. Right, the power. You don't understand how Jake loves. Man, that bitch jump walked by like five times. Jake yeah. loves that power. Shot. Jake loves his fly ass rides, just like King Solomon. Where's that at? Uh, Song of Solomon. Who we'll describes oh, his ride? Yeah, let me, get that. let me get that. Yeah, this shit. Yeah, yeah. But he had a giant. You want to hold this real quick? I gotta go. I'll go ahead. Yeah. They say he had a giant stable yeah, horse. Yeah, too. Yeah. I can imagine. You know how? Uh, what do you call them? Budweiser horses? Those uh, Clydesdales? Those are some bad, beautiful ass horses, man. I mean, yeah. they're huge. They're bigger than a normal horse. They're higher and everything, man. Those Clyde fields is nice. Solomon had some shit. I don't know what kind of horses they had back then. Oh, you got it. See them, man? Just yeah. Here it is. They won't, um, they won't tell you Solomon never lived. Right, Here it is. Right, they're right, the richest man right. that ever lived don't exist. Right. Wise, right. <laughs> right. Dumbasses. Sol Song of Solomon 3 and um, 7. Uh, no. 8, 9. King Solomon made himself a chariot of the wood of Lebanon. He made the pillars thereof of silver, the poles that held it together. Oh. The bottom thereof of gold. <laughs> a chariot made of gold. Right. The covering of it of purple, the mist thereof of being paved with love for the daughters of Jerusalem. Yeah, just a so, so that just is a description of yeah, cause that's Jake Spirit. He likes yeah. to get some damn spinner rims and <laughs> fly shit. He yeah, likes fly shit. And he if you got some fly shit, son. your shit's getting jacked, son. You know what I mean? Your shit, you have about a week for your shit gets put up on blocks. <laughs> right, right. Because most people got their rims, they didn't pay for them. Yeah, right. They, they jacked them themselves. Yep. Right? Stole them themselves. That's well, another. Those that, are all those uh, all those rib shops always getting broken into. Oh yeah. Because they be running scams. Because I know dude, one dude was uh, I, I was overhearing him talking at a party one time, and he owned his rim shop, and you know, 
insurance scams and shit. Let niggas go in there and take what they want, get away, file insurance scams. Niggas ain't shit, man. Niggas always. They always got a scheme. The scripture says they're wise to do evil, but. But well, they have much wisdom and they have much wisdom and uh, foolishness. Dumbass wisdom and mis mischievousness. <laughs> um, yeah, Jake always got he always got that the, the, the deal. Like when a new video game system out, when a new video game system come out, there's always Jake somewhere. He got the got the <laughs> the, the real low low bottom dollar price for your ass. Right, right. Where am I listening over there? What's that on big? Some bullshit. Some bullshit. The NFL draft or some shit. I'm about to zoom in on that shit. Let me read that scripture right here. Okay. Isaiah 24. Isaiah 24 and 5. The earth also is defiled under the inhabitants thereof because they have transgressed the laws, changed the ordinances. Ordinance, ordinance. Or, ordinance broken the everlasting covenant therefore hath the curse devoured the earth the curse. and they that dwell therein are desolate therefore the inhabitants of the earth are burnt and few men left <laughs> there goes that getting burnt by that fire again <laughs> right right the new wine mourneth the vine languisheth all the merry hearted do sigh the yep. mirth of tabrets ceases. Yeah, they, uh, fuck all. That's talking about your bullshit music you be blasting. Yeah. Like the mirth. Them, yeah. yeah. All this happiness. Everybody yeah. all happy partying. Yeah, yeah. Listen all to of it's the can. All of it's the can. All of it's the can. They all. What it is? These people are in denial. They don't want it to happen. They gonna so they gonna fucking just ignore it till the shit is well, what, completely just, destroyed. Yeah, just wait till you go to that party. And that goddamn ATM is empty. <laughs> right. You know what right, I'm saying? Right. And that this shit. shit ain't even turned on. Right, right. You know what I'm saying? You need some money to get some gas in that car to get home. Bank banks are gonna be closed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Y'all, all of y'all is gonna have all your savings took in one day. <laughs> oh. the, the, of, the noise of them that rejoice ended. The joy uh, of the uh, heart ceases. Read that again. I, this is my good part. From the top. Right. No, that one part you just read. The joy ceases. Okay. <laughs> Isaiah 24. Isaiah 24 and 8. The mirth of Tabrit ceases. The noise of them that rejoice ended. Mm. The joy of the heart ceases. That's another thing. Do they always cheering for some goddamn football or NBA? Always cheering and having a good time. <laughs> they shall not drink wine with the song. <laughs> Strong drink shall be bitter to them that drink it. Drink a wine with songs right now. Yeah, they over there playing right that now. bullshit. Right now. But well, you got all these clubs down. That's why you all these women walk around looking like whores. Look at them. Look at them. Look at her. She just ain't wearing shoes. Oh, well, she I claimed her. Right. Oh, I claimed her five minutes ago. Yeah, yeah, she she struck them hips. She's a freak thing too. Right? She, yeah. she looks like she high as that. She, she, she sure does. Like she walk around like she's a super badass. Well, she knows she gonna get, get her on camera. Time. Oh yeah. Or some no. She knows she gonna get some pussy tonight. She get her she on get, camera. They look for that bitch. She needs some pussy too. Yeah, both. Yeah, both. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You a scientist? I mean, these women want to walk around with it. I can see the titties and everything. What's up, y'all? Y'all know that's an abomination. Yeah, that's a. Yeah, that's disgusting. That looks like Pat and Pat. <laughs> Pat and Pat. The two Pats. Revelations 2. Uh, damn. Isaiah 24. Pat and Pat. 24. Pat and Pat. 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 Isaiah 24. 24 and 10. The city of confusion and is broken down. It's the city of confusion. America is the city of confusion. Columbus is women. You see two fat ass lesbians holding hands. That's confusing. You believe in the Bible? Yes, I do. You? Terry told me. Where you from? 
I'm here. What's up? Uh, North East. What's the deal? No, no, not that far. Just Central. Can I see different? Oh, you grew up in a white neighborhood? No, I did not. Oh, no. Yeah. No, I started. Yeah. Which Texas? International Texas. He, he wants to be culturally diverse. Is that right? <laughs> yeah. So you, uh, you, you didn't hear the latest news? No. There ain't no jobs out there. Oh. So you didn't you want to school for nothing. Oh, I, I completely understand that. I'm actually a small business owner as well. So that's, what kind of small business owner? Uh, I partner with several neighboring companies. So one of the companies that I'm working with right now is Artistry. Right. All that's going to run dry too. Though. I understand. Yeah. Everything's going to run dry. Eventually. Soon, it's coming in front of the Oh, I, I read Revelation. Read the news too. Like go to, uh, uh, go to the financial news. The NIA. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm I'm this shit is going down quick. I just, yeah, going I know. Quick. My girlfriend actually is very uh, proactive in that. Aspect. Who you at, Junior, Senior? Yeah. What kind of debt you in right now? Oh, I'm a full rights guy. Told you, man. Smart guy. You got to be so proud of right now. You cooperating with the system. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you got to learn how to play the game in order to get out you know, the game. You know, but this is the way you get out the game, right? Yeah. <laughs> hey, this is the real knowledge and understanding. Real. So where are you from? Columbus. Uh, where are your ancestors from? I have no idea. I wish I did. I know that my last name is European. It comes from England. Uh, prior. It means head of the monastery. Prior. prior. Yeah, that's where you get words like free. Yeah. yeah. Actually, I, it took me a while to actually like learn all of that stuff. But even after that, it doesn't really help me because I know it's not my original family. Was your father was from over there? No, um, probably just somewhere back in the line. Um, oh, yeah. The original family last name was Blocky, and that was just something that they claimed for themselves. Or a could be a or something. <clears throat> that could be your slave master's last name. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Yeah. Possibly. Or even though you had dark skinned people that lived over there in England, though, don't you know? Yeah, that? actually, before they were before they were here. Yeah. Do you have a King James Bible? <laughs> yes. You know, King James was a black man. I did not. Know that. <laughs> I did not know that. I knew that he wasn't. I knew he wasn't just so European. Well, he was. I know that they burned the Egyptian Icon archives and they tore the Icon. nose off of the Sphinx and Icon. they didn't stole a lot of the culture that was in Egypt, especially the knowledge that Yeah, but Egypt, you know the Egypt, Egyptians were a bunch of heathens. Yeah. Because you know the Bible doesn't speak too nicely about Egypt. No, not at, not at all. You know what I'm saying? But, but, the, Bible, the Lord destroyed Egypt. Yeah. Now there's a cesspool of wickedness, sorcery and witchcraft. Yeah, well, and that was what uh, people talk about sorcery a lot. I was talking, referencing, I think to my girlfriend, I was telling her that um, when Moses was there, they were trying to compete with their sorcery against God. Um, oh, yeah, they had a battle. Yeah, so oh, a, lot of the things yeah, yeah. That, a lot of the things that were in the archives were the same thing that science is doing now, trying to create life and to, to step into that that supernatural realm of science is going to go well, I'm going to hit you with something. You know, what's the original name of Egypt? What did they call it? They call it, uh, they come from the word, you know the word ham in the Bible? Well, it's really ham. But they call it Kemet. You ever heard of Kemet? My girlfriend was telling me. Uh, they call it, well, that's what they call it. I mean, that's, uh, Kemet comes from the Bible word ham. Okay. All right. Now, now, the word alchemy, Alchemy derives from the word Kemet, okay, because that was they was doing the little potions or whatever, yeah. and then that's where you get the modern word chemistry. Yeah, chemistry I do comes know from that. Kemet, okay. So that's why you have a lot of these chemists 
They up in the laboratory creating all these crazy new drugs. OSU. Yeah, OSU. Well, that's like uh, the ancient word for, I think it was sorcery, was pharmacia. Well, pharm yeah, right. Which goes, that's where you get pharmacy. Yeah, pharmacy. So that's part of that sorcery and the witchcraft. Because you know, over a, out, a study just came out a few months ago. It said over 70% of the American population are hooked on some kind of pain pills. I pain, it. pain medication. I listened to like uh, mm. my, my girlfriend's neighbor mm. talks about the, just taking pills just to feel that it's like you don't need it. Right? What it is, they put you in a trance like state. That's how they control you through there. That's part of their witchcraft. Have you ever read some book, uh, Breakers? Uh, yeah, well, uh, Huxley. Yeah, yeah. It, ex it explores just that because people, people talk about how uh, 1984 is no longer plausible and things like that, but the new, uh, Brave New World kind of even just talks about pretty much the Bible incarnate. Um, if you look deeper into it. Right. But America's on this is each of all over. Yeah. You know, um, Revelation 11 and 8. Well, yeah, you see there's a pyramid on the back of a dollar. Right, right out in the open. The Washington Monument is an Egyptian obelisk. Yeah. You know? What's that all about? Yeah, they guys got the pyramids over in uh, Vegas. Yeah, pyramid in Vegas. Oh, what they call Vegas. In Luxor. Uh, and that means light. So they're saying ancient Egypt is light. It was, it was actually a good name for uh, Vegas. City, 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 city. Uh, city. City. Revelation 11 and 8, and their dead bodies shall lie in the street of the great city, America, which spiritually is called Sodom and Egypt. Yeah, because America, you see all the Sodomites out here. <laughs> yeah, did you just hear about the story about Nintendo? You, you know, uh, Nintendo has some new life simulation game. I forget the name of it. But uh, they, they didn't. You can get married in the game, which is a little fake. It's kind of like the Sims. Yeah, yeah. But the homosexuals are mad because Nintendo Man, refuses. So put the, yeah, I was just gay people something in. about that. So the, so the gay people don't. If you speak out against homosexuals, they'll try to end your career. They'll destroy yeah. Them. yeah. I just think it's interesting because that's why they say homosexuality. Yeah. I mean, in truth, God is pro-choice because otherwise He's he wouldn't have given us freedom in the first place. That's really yeah. awesome. The My problem is, you don't want us to, you want to speak and be free with your mouth. But if anybody else has their own opinion, you have a problem with that. Well, free, free will is an illusion. There really is no free will. There's an illusion of free will, but there's really no free will. This is Job? Yeah, Job uh, 33. Job 33 is somewhere. Yeah, because, yeah, you can read that. It's definitely a thing. There's no free will. Oh, um, 33 and 14. Job 33 and 14. For the most high speaketh once, yea, twice, yet man perceiveth it not. In a dream, in a dream. Yeah, that's it. In a dream, in a vision of the night, when deep sleep falleth upon men, and slumberings upon the bed, then he openeth the ears of men and sealeth their instructions. So the Lord says, "Aren't he? Pro we're all programmed. Most high, pro pretty much programmed. You do what you do. You think you made that choice, but not really. The Lord is guiding everything. I believe that. The smallest thing from the ant forward. It's like it's, to the great things. Yeah, because you think you got free will." Then that would mean there's no such thing as coincidences. You know what I mean? I mean, how do you explain a coincidence? That's one of the craziest things ever. A coincidence. We out here every Thursday, man. We out here morning. By that destruction. It's coming. It's coming. It's hard, man. You guys have a blessed day. Uh, yeah, I got a goddamn toothache. I got stomach problems and shit. Fuck. You know what I mean? Back problems and shit. Yeah, you can't you can't get a whole week without no kind of pains and aches and right, shit. Right, can't go through the whole year, right? You can't go through the Yeah, once I got a toothache, I'm when a toothache stops, then my shoulder gonna act up. Right. You know what I mean? One thing or another. <laughs> One thing or another.
never have enough money to do what you want or you know, do what you need to do. There's so much shit we want to do, man. I want to get new signs. Fucked up world, man. We trying to do the right thing in the truth, man. We can't even do it, man. Over the most high blessings with something, you know. You can't have a family and raise children. You can't even raise your children. Own seed. Own seed. Own seed. You'll see. Yours. You shot it. You shot You shot the fuck and You shot it out. He saw it, dude. Oh, yeah, because in America, it's legal for a woman to murder her baby. But she don't have to get permission from the man. Now, that's, that's my genetic material up in that bitch. Man. I got to say so. This bitch was in the hospital the other day, man. She had nine kids. Nine kids. Ain't got custody of none of them. She's pregnant with another. Now, why are they going after her? Why do they keep asking her if you know where any of the fathers are? They trying to go after the fathers, but that bitch should be held responsible too. Uh, she ain't, but she can get child support. Jake, keep having she babies. She's going to see another kid. But she's giving birth to another one attempt. Hey, she probably got welfare for all of them. She probably getting $3,000 a month in food stamps. You know what I mean? They go after the fathers. These bitches them. ain't shit. Yeah, these devils ain't shit either. America's about to be destroyed. Y'all know that? That destruction's coming soon, man. There goes your boy. They go welcome to Jam Rock. That's your boy. What's your boy? They got locked up. Move you up. Move you. What's your boy got locked up in New York? Lucia, is that that Lucia? Lucia. He shot the cop. Back to that. Oh, yeah. I see him get on the bus. He escaped. <laughs> <laughs> he, is, he got out. I hope the full scale war kicks off, man, before the summer so these people can have a miserable life, man. So they can have a miserable summer. Y'all know cannibalism's coming to the streets? Oh, they already have with that shit. Oh, they eat people in Africa. They do that shit in Ethiopia. They you where, so we can get where. Y'all know, y'all know Africans That's Esau for are cannibals. Y'all know that? Esau for real. Hey, Esau is a cannibal, too. That's why they drink children's blood. They say it makes them live longer. Passover blood. Passover blood. Yeah, there's all kind of reports of all these uh, rich people. They they drink children's blood. It was they, on it was on a drugs report the other day. They had a, a a scientific study came out that said that children's blood will make you live longer. Hey, you know those Jews ain't going out snatching people in their own. Hell no. They got they got Israel doing that shit through their jobs. Yep. Because oh, yeah. the other day, man, up, baby? 